there, friends, and welcome back to the channel. If you are new around these parts, hello. Thank you so, so much for clicking in today's video. I'm back with another plan with me, and I am planning my first Christmas spread of the season, which is so, 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 so exciting. <laughs> so I did not think, honestly, I didn't think I'd be here this soon. Um, I'm doing this voiceover on the wee hours of, or in the wee hours of January 16th. It is just coming up on 7 a.m. But I actually, oddly, got up with enough time. I basically forced myself to get up uh, for work. So I do have a little bit of time to kill. Very little, but I think I can get through this base. We'll see how it goes. Um, but what am I using for this week? I don't know if I said I'm planning for the week of December 4th, but I'm planning for the week of December 4th. <laughs> and I'm using this groovy Christmas kit. I think it was called Groovy Christmas from Caress Press. It is just perfection. As soon as it came out, I knew I'd be using it. It is so, so beautiful. I love the kind of traditional but non-traditional colors. <laughs> like they're very traditional, but also very non-traditional. I know that makes no sense probably, but I don't know. Maybe it's like the, the tone of the colors that give non-traditional, but it's just so fun. Um, and it took me a long time to figure out what to pair this with. But I ended up landing on the Gold Hollow Foil Bundle from um, Planner Choco. She did, or they did, I should say, um, a groovy Christmas themed foil release. So I picked up some of that. And then these underlays, which are so fun. They're in like a sparkly gold confetti kind of vibe. Gold Hollow confetti kind of vibe. Um in in a christmas tree format and this is actually from magical sticker co which i think this is the first time i'm using underlays from her shop i think the last time i used something from her shop was probably scripts and y'all know i don't use scripts that often although i am trying to get into the script game for 2024 so we'll see i'm trying to get into this like custom multi-life because i just hate writing in my planner <laughs> like Y'all know this. I do not like writing my planner. Um, but we'll see. We'll see what happens with that. I need to I need to like sit down and see like what I need for custom multi. I think that's where I get like not overwhelmed, but like, oh, this is too much work. <laughs> it's the five. I'm like, I sit down and I'm like, okay, maybe not now. Maybe I'll do this later. So maybe overwhelmed is the word. I don't know. It's early. Alas. Um, I love, love, love how this turned out. They're not an exact match. The foils, like the underlays and the rest of the foil are not an exact match, but they're pretty dang close. Um, they kind of bring in those same elements with the sparkle of the gold hollow and then with these underlays as well. So I don't know what Magical Sticker Co. actually called this foil because this was like her sale foil exclusive, I think. Like, it's I don't think it's in shop anymore. Like, I think it was exclusive to the sale. Um, but I really wish she would bring it back because I think it is stunning. And I'm also glad that she has started to do underlays. I'm not sure exactly when that started, but I'm here for it. So I'm going to keep an eye on her next release whenever she has them for some fun underlays because the foiling on this was fantastic I must say fan freaking tastic so shout out to Lindsay for that but yeah so that's what I'm using I think that covers just about everything this one is a talk through which is exciting for all my talk through friends I hope y'all love it um but yeah I think that's it I am about to descend upon the first week of classes so pray for your girl because it's my least fave, <laughs> but it's, I just have to keep reminding myself it's a spring semester and you can get through this. So I'm gonna keep telling myself that and hope that that sticks. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, um, I'm gonna be talking through a lot of what I did this week. So I'm not gonna chat about that in like this base portion, but I will tell you what I've been up to lately. I've been designing. Um, and I think I mentioned in another plan with me that I was designing the Easter in Wonderland art um, from Clip Art Kits. And then I have an exclusive art that I'm designing right now. And then I might throw 
that Japan art in there. We'll see if I have enough time. I'm about halfway through the exclusive kit and I want to get that out soon because I think, I mean, it could be used anytime, but I do have an idea of when I think might be a good time to use it. So I kind of want to get that out soon. So we'll see if I have enough time to do the Japan art that Clip Art Kits just released like yesterday, real time. By the time you guys see this, it'll be like a week ago. So we'll see. By the time you see this, we may have sneaks on Instagram, I hope. I don't know if this if the releases will be up, but we'll hopefully have some sneaks on Instagram. I did share a sneak of the Easter kit, which I really love how the boxes turned out for that. So yeah, it's, I feel like I'm in my designing bag. Like this past weekend was a long weekend because um, we had MLK day yesterday, real time again, probably like a week ago for y'all when y'all are watching this. But I was, I went into the weekend and I was like, okay, I'm going to be productive. I'm going to um, do some plan with me so I can catch up and y'all I don't think I filmed at all this weekend. I was just engrossed in designing. And this is how I get when I design. This is why it's so hard for me to balance it with everything else because I design and I'm just like my brain will not shut off about it. Like it'll be like, no, you need to go fix this box right now before you forget. It's like, no, you can like jot it down and you can circle back to it. <laughs> and I really do need to take breaks because I think that's what helps like it come together the best when you can step away from it and then look at it again. But alas, if you are a shop owner or design kits of your own, let me know. Or if you do printables, because I mean, those obviously come like all set for you. But I think with printables, you have the option to like tweak things a bit. So I wonder if those of you who use printables find that to be to be a thing as well. I'm just like, I just need to just do it. Anyways, <laughs> it's my own trash. I'll get over it. But I think we're heading into the talk through. So I'll see you guys in a sec. All right, y'all. Here I am attempting to do a talk through. Um, you already know, subject to all the noises, I'll do my best to not have them come up. But yes, hello. But hello again. Where are my tweezers? Okay. So this week, what was this week? I gotta pull up my notes. Like I have my, I have a little bit of stickers pulled, to be honest. Most of them are not pulled, but. Okay, so Monday the 4th, I called out of work this day because I was, I just needed a mental health day, y'all. I was so mentally drained. And I think it has mostly to do with the fact that November was so horrid at work. Um, and you already know, I sound like a broken record. The fall semester is just much more difficult than the spring one, just in terms of pace and everything that happens in the fall and this is crooked. So I feel like we all come out of the fall semester um, on the struggle bus, if I can be quite honest. And so I asked my boss if she would allow me to work remotely. And she said yes, because she is just a doll. And the only reason I'm doing this this day, why does this still look crooked? <sighs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm also on my period, so I feel unreasonably rageful. Um, anyone else feel that way when they're on their period? Just unreasonably rageful. And let me tell you, that in particular has gotten worse with age. Because I feel like I never used to feel quite this rageful before. <laughs> uh, but it's fine. So I feel like that is still crooked but it's staying I can't I don't have the bandwidth um so yeah so I pretty much begged my boss to let me work from home this day and she obliged because she is just every damn thing which I don't know how oh I think I probably switched my appointments to virtual because I'm like I would have been booked so <laughs> yeah we love her 
so much. I'm gonna use a little thing. I think I'm gonna use the yellow one. And then I was just having, again, because I was so drained from November, having such a hard time getting out of bed forever, basically until break. Like the only thing keeping me going through December was the fact that I knew break was coming because otherwise I just wouldn't have made it. <laughs> I just would not have made it. So the um, overwhelmed girl here, in pink is from Sweet Freckle Designs, I believe is her new shop name. It used to be Caffeine and Paper Co. It was something else before. She's gone through a lot of name changes. Um, and then I used this munchkin, dragging another one out of bed, and that's from Once More With Love. And then I worked on orders this day, so I marked that using a squidge from Stick With The Plan Co. And I got takeout this day. I think I need to use a bigger box, actually, because I don't have a lot to mark for Monday at all. It was actually the bulk of the day was orders. Um, so I really don't have much to mark. So I think I'm going to use this square box to mark takeout. Um, we got, oh, I don't want to use those patterns together, but do I, how much do I care? I care enough to change it. Mm, <laughs> I'll use this one instead. No, that matches. You know what? You know what, bro? Jeez. Okay. Shit. <laughs> like, what the hell? Um, I'm using a little bucket of chicken from Carly Plans. This is a Carly Plans doodle to mark takeout. We got chicken. I don't think it was fried chicken. I think it was... Um, let me put these back because I'm not going to be able to do anything with them attached to me like this. So we're just going to put them back. I got chicken from this Dominican restaurant that's near us. And it was delish. Ah, let's use, can I use these? Let's use green. Yep, let's use green. I tried to use this box on the washi page for crust press or the 15 millimeter page for crust press as soon as possible. Because if I don't, I'll forget about it and then I'll be so annoyed that I didn't use it because it's the only thing left on that little sheet. And then I marked that I was annoyed because my pins still had not arrived this day. And I have talked about the whole pin saga in another video, so I won't bring it up, but. It has since been resolved for those of you who were praying and hoping for me that I would get my money back. Etsy did intervene and gave me my money back because they knew it was the right thing to do because homegirl, who still never responded, I just, I'm debating whether or not I want to leave a bad review, but I kind of feel like I should, to be honest, to be completely transparent. Okay, um, so then... For Tuesday, I was back in the office after being remote, which again, just so freaking hard to get out of bed. So I'm pulling in some Christmassy stickers because if I don't pull them in now, I'm not gonna. So this little Christmas laptop munchkin is from Once More With Love. I'm going to mark coffee. What do I want to use to mark coffee? I just love these bigger little things. Little things are too little for me, y'all, so I love the bigger ones. Like, they're everything. They're everything. Um, okay, so I'm gonna mark coffee, and this little reindeer coffee cup is also from Once More With Love. There's gonna be a lot of Once More With Love, and I feel like Fox and Cactus in this spread, because those are my, the main shops that I have Christmas things from. I should like, okay, let me organize my life a little bit here. I don't need this, I need this, I need this, I need this, okay. Because <laughs> I had pages that I really did not need. Um, what was that? Do I have a foil page in here? No? Okay. Okay, uh, next thing I'm going to mark, what am I marking? I was having commuter struggles, which is nothing new, to be honest. I think I should do a patterned box. Hmm. I think I'm gonna do this one. 
to green, pull in a little bit more green in there. Two more commuter struggles and this annoyed dog. I think it's an annoyed dog. Character is from Fox and Cactus. And then I'm trying to make sure I'm in frame. I feel so rusty. It has not been that long yet. I feel very rusty. Okay, and then what are we marking? Do, 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 do. I had plenty of meetings this day. I think I want to use a solid to mark that. Well, two meetings, but for me, that's plenty. That's plenty of meetings. I think I want to use green. I'm going to use this green one here. Break up the fancy labels a little bit. And I'm going to use this, and I'm going to mark meetings. They were not all virtual meetings, but that's what I found first. So I'm going to mark this little Zoom munchkin. Yeah. <laughs> it went okay. It went okay, but not fantastic. I'll just leave it at that. So I have a, like, just over it munchkin, actually an over it emoji from the Coffee Monsters Co. because I didn't know how else to mark that. It wasn't that big of a deal, but I'm still kind of getting used to these dynamics, <laughs> per se. So it is definitely a learning curve. Okay, I'm going to use a little thing here. Last. And what am I marking here? Oh yeah, I had three meetings today. God, so many meetings. Um, food. I had McDonald's. I think I'm going to mark that because I don't have anything else I need to mark. So I don't have anything pulled. So this is where we're going to start pulling stickers. Like I only pulled four those couple days. It's a little thing. So I think I'm going to use this little chicken nugget sticker from Beneva Creations. Oh, that's a shop I really... I was just kind of browsing at some character shops to shop from because I feel like, I don't remember, I think maybe Sticky Perks was the last thing that I purchased from a non-kit shop, maybe? And I feel like it's time. Like there's some of my like tried and true that I've run out of, but I'm trying to force myself to use other stickers. So it's going to be time to re-up soon. Um, okay. Okay. So Wednesday, I went to Dunkin'. Looks like I got a bagel and donuts. This must have been a craving because I rarely go to Dunkin', y'all. It's actually, it's funny, I actually went to Dunkin' today too. Um, what's happening, Anna? Are you trying to tell yourself something? Uh, I don't go there very often, but apparently it's been a kick I'm on. But yeah, it's not a place I'm at very often. Uh, I think I'll use this pattern. So I'm gonna mark Duncan for Wednesday. Had to check if we were in frame. I'm hoping I get through this before my meeting, but I don't think I'm going to. But boy, do I want to. Okay, I'm like, this feels crooked. It might be a little crooked, but it is what it is. And I'm going to mark emails with a lot more curved boxes. Uh, Crest Press has a new format, y'all. Have you seen it? She has a new format, and I'm very excited about it. Uh, I think I'm going to use this red one for the little thing. Here. Is this our new? No, this is not our new format. I was like, wait, is this one in our new format? No, it literally just came out. This is definitely not that one. Okay, so we're going to mark Duncan, which I have a bagel sticker somewhere because that's basically what I got. So let's see if I can find my bagel sticker. I don't think I have a Duncan sticker because I really don't go that often, y'all. If I find my donut stickers, I'll use those. I found my donut stickers first, so I'm gonna use those. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna use the poo one. These are fun. I'm gonna use the poo one. Um, this is from Paper and Milk. I love the theming of those cute little donuts. So marking that, and then we're marking emails. 
since I was covering for my supervisee because she was out that day, which is fine. Um, <laughs> could just use it with a like laptop girl. I kind of want to use this girl. She's so cute. This cute girl is from Paper Bits Co. I just re-upped on this cutie. Ugh, I love her. So cute. Um, okay, and then what else was I gonna mark? I can't remember. <laughs> I cannot remember what I was gonna mark, but I am gonna mark coffee. Again, again, and I'm gonna try to use a seasonal sticker for this because I have the coffee mugs, the seasonal coffee mugs, or if there's another one, I'll use that. Oh, I can definitely use this one. We'll leave this out for something else I wanna mark. Um, yeah, I'm gonna use the coffee cups, I think. Let's see, I used the reindeer one already. Let's use the peppermint one. Cute. It's also brown though. Use the snowman. She mark coffee. Ooh, let's stick that in seasonal. Then I was working on a project and <laughs> yeah, that involves students. And that's always interesting to say the least. So, I don't want to mark that. I'm due for a solid. Oh, I know what I'm going to use to mark that. I just need to pick the label. Yeah, I gotta do a solid. What are my solids? Here we go. Okay, so we did red. Let's do pink, I think. I'm going to use this one. Oops. <clears throat> I think it's hilarious that I'm like, I don't go to Dunkin' that much, and I just went today. <laughs> oh, you're trying to fool, Anna. I really don't, though. I kind of live at Starbucks instead, because there's one right next to my job, which is a problem. I'm going to use this, like, lights frustrated. <laughs> Christmas lights frustrated munchkin from Once and Worth Love. It's from a little holiday deco sampler, if you guys want to see. I'm gonna use that to mark my frustration with students in this project. And then the only other thing I have left to mark is that I was exhausted. So I'm gonna use a big box to mark that. I'm gonna use this one. I think I have a, um, I think a Fox and Pip girl that would work well here. It's a big sticker. So I'm gonna try to do that. Let's find her. She would be under sleep and tired. This could be cute too, this but first sleep. Let's see. Oh no, I found her and I'd rather use her. She's hugging her pillow. I love, see, this is one of the ones I need to up on, re-up on. I love sleep. Sheet from Fox and Pip. <sighs> I don't know how I'm going to keep up, y'all. <laughs> There's so many things I want to buy all the time, and I'm not rich enough for that. Okay? Okay. So, there's that. I love it. I love it, love it, love it. There's how the first half of the week is looking. It's so pretty. Oh, I love it. Okay. Let's move on to the second half. I am going to need to take a break soon to get to my meeting, which I say get to, but y'all know what I mean. It's just on Zoom, but I need to have my meeting, I guess I should say. Um, okay, so Thursday, not too much to mark there either. I'm going to use a square box if I can find it. Here we go. And I'm going to use this one use a pattern. I love this pattern. I keep gravitating towards this pattern. I love this freaking kit, you guys. And this artist, mm, so good. Okay, I'm gonna mark Starbies because I went to El Starbies and got my matcha green tea latte. Does anyone else get matcha? Is that their go-to go drink at Starbucks? Because if it is, I'm here to tell you that haagen ice cream? I don't know if I said that right, but we're just going to run with it. Sells a matcha latte flavored ice cream. Friends. 
friends. <laughs> I'm here to tell you that it is freaking fantastic. <laughs> it's so good. It's literally the drink in ice cream form. It's so good. It's a little small, I'm realizing, but I think I'm gonna keep it because I love my matcha stickers and I don't have that many. You know where I can get some more matcha stickers? From Paper and Milk. Definitely. So eventually I will do that. But anyways, marking Starbies, and then I'm gonna mark that I had a staff meeting this day. This week was not super eventful, to be completely transparent. It really wasn't that eventful. Um, so I don't have a ton to mark this day. But we're gonna mark a meeting. I think I'm gonna use, probably anyway, you're gonna use a seasonal sticker to mark it. So let's go into my seasonal stickers. Let's see what would work. Um, I think I have a Christmas working girl. I'll probably just use that to mark work in general. I just need to find her. Grinchy girls, listen. <laughs> listen, babes. I am indeed a Grinchy girl. Here we go. Okay, she is going to be facing this away. Super cute from Fox and Cactus. Oh, and the Starbucks cup is from Sticky Perks. And I don't know if I missed some stickers i might have missed some stickers you guys so if you have questions let me know i don't i think i got through all of these but just in case so then for the bottom of thursday i am going to mark watching tv with bay it was literally like that boring <laughs> like of a day where i really do not have much to mark um hmm. i'm gonna do i guess this works Ooh, I'm gonna use this cute little candy cane munchkin because it's adorable. And then I'm gonna mark watching YouTube because that's literally all that happened. Look at this cute little munchkin with this peppermint candy cane heart. I'm just gonna use it to mark with Bay. Watching TV. And then I have one more thing to mark. Let's see. So sorry if you hear the upstairs neighbor's dog barking. It's a thing. I think I'm gonna use green. I don't know why I keep, it's like the only thing that's not represented. So I'm gonna use green. Okay, Um, and I'm gonna mark YouTube. I was like, what am I marking? <laughs> YouTube. And then I need to run to my meeting. For real, for real. For real, for real, for real, I need to run. Okay, well, let's use this. This is cute. This is a little like panda, I think, a little panda YouTube sticker from Happy Daya. And that is Thursday, y'all. I'm going to run to my meeting and then I'm hoping to come back and finish up this spread with y'all. Okay, meeting adjourned. Back to the fun. <laughs> It was going to be, I knew it was going to be quick, so. Okay, so moving on to Friday. Let's start with the solid. Let's do red. Yeah, let's do red. Don't want to do a fancy. No, let's do this one. So we're going to start with red on Friday. And I'm going to mark that I was up early. And then I had a hair appointment this day. And I was annoyed because my... Hair girl came late again. She's been coming in so late, y'all, and it's so annoying. Um, I think I'm gonna use this. I'm 108% tired. I'm gonna take up too much of that box, actually, so nope. Oh, I'm gonna use this little bear from Paper Bits Co. So cute because it's side-eyeing the sun and it's a mood. And then for my hair, I'm gonna pull, let's see, don't use that fox and cactus. I kinda do, I kinda do wanna use that fox and cactus. Not to mention, you guys, I just texted my hair girl because I need to get my hair done, actually. 
and she has not responded yet. I gave her no inkling that I was annoyed, by the way. <laughs> she doesn't know that I was annoyed, even though I was very annoyed. Um, and she was apologetic, but it's like, come on, man, like, please respect my time because I don't have a lot of it. Um, okay, so... I think I might... Uh, I think I'm going to do one of these. Should I do the ho-ho-ho? I'm going to do the ho-ho-ho. And I think I want to use another big little thing. Underneath that... I need to cook, y'all. Where's my, there's a sheet, here it is. I'm like, there's a sheet that has big little things on the bottom. It's this one. I'm like, am I in frame? Yes, I am. <laughs> okay, so, to mark being up early, I have this Paper Bits Cobair. To mark washing my hair, I have this character from Ohana Story, and then I'm going to mark work. I was gonna mark being annoyed at my hairstylist, but like it looks like I have a lot to mark today, so we're not gonna mark that. Um, I like marking this with. Did I run out of that sticker? No. Okay, good. I like using this. In the zone girl from my work from home days. So we're gonna use her. She's so cute. And she has glasses, which I particularly love. Fox and Pip is, I think, underrated in my opinion. In my opinion, underrated. Because I love Fox and Pip stickers. Okay, and then I was having shop owner troubles because my printer was like, mm mm. Oh, did you want to get something done? Oh, that's cute. We're not doing that. Um, and I was literally ready to do, I was doing a lot of this, a lot of this. You guys will see in a minute, I just pulled it. Um, let's, I don't wanna mark this. Let's use my last little circle. It's not a circle, it's a curved box, but whatever. Raise this. Need more of these labels. I love these labels. And I'm gonna use a squidge to mark my printer troubles. And I'm gonna mark that I was stressed. Super stressed, actually. Where's my negative emotions? Cause that's gonna be the rest of this day. I was just really struggling this day because I was very stressed about orders because my printer was giving me so many issues this day. This was the week I think that I bought a new printer or maybe that's next week and I still have that printer. I could return it but I almost kind of want to have it there on standby. Am I crazy for that y'all? My boyfriend thinks I'm crazy for that. He's like no get your money back. I'm like but ooh, I'd rather be prepared so I'm not scurrying next time and he's like yeah, get your money back. <laughs> He's unamused. Unamused. What am I going to use? I feel like I should actually use one of these babies. I think I'm going to use this red one. I feel like these are a little bit too big. Oh, I don't want to use two in a row of those. Mm. Oh well, because I don't want to use the square one either. Do I? No, I don't. I don't. I'm going to use this. And I'm gonna mark rock bottom because I was had like the whole printer situation. I was stressed about orders, and then my mom called me because my dad was having an episode. So it was a really bad Friday night for show. Moving on to Saturday, it was one of my besties' birthdays, which is so exciting. I love her so much, and I miss her so freaking much. I don't think she watches these videos, but if she does, she's going to know who she is. Because I only have one bestie whose birthday is on December 9th. But I love her so freaking much. Uh, I need to go see her one of these days, but it's so hard. It's so hard. What do I want to use? Okay, we're going to use a solid because I'm just... 
losing my mind over here. We're gonna use solid. I guess we're gonna use pink because that's the only thing left. And we're gonna mark birthday. I would use a seasonal Christmas sticker, but she does not like Christmas at all. So we're gonna use a regular old birthday sticker. She doesn't want her birthday either, but it's okay. I'm still marking it. If you're watching, I'm still marking it because you deserve to be celebrated. Ooh, ooh, I'm using this one. Yep, I'm using this one, definitely. The Shop with Anna East Girl with the Donut Cake is one of my favorite stickers that I own. So cute. So, mark her birthday, and then we went, or no, we door dashed IHOP, which was so like, I don't know why we do this to ourselves because we know it's expensive AF, but here we are. Here we are. I guess I'm gonna use this to mark that. And then I did more printing and cutting of orders. That was basically my day, to be quite frank. So, <laughs> basically my day. We're gonna have to use a small one for this. So yeah, there's that. Okay, so I wanna mark breakfast or takeout, whatever. Oh, I need just generic takeout bags. Oh look, I have a DoorDash bag. I forgot that I have a DoorDash bag. Look at the word work. I'm gonna use the white one, I think. This is from Sticky Perks. And then I'm going to mark working on orders. which I think I'm just gonna mark my portrait for that. It doesn't look like it is giving me issues, but I think this is when I was cutting the stickers and realized, I think maybe the next day on Sunday, I realized that they were all cut incorrectly and I wanted to just quit. I just wanted to quit right there. I was like, that's it. That's the end of my sticker shop owner life. No longer will I endure such travesties. Okay, and then, what? Oh, okay, here we go. Oh, crap, okay. Um, then, I mean, it's still accurate-ish. I basically put, like, IHOP actually happened on Sunday. I'm not changing it though, so it's staying right the F there, but, to be completely transparent. It's wrong. Okay, we're going to use a dish to mark that we got pizza this day, which is correct. Okay, so we've got pizza and then I'm going to mark YouTube. And I worked on orders, but I'm not gonna mark that again. It's clear that I just was working on orders forever and ever and ever. So let's mark pizza. It was an eat out kind of day. I was working on orders, so that took up most of my time. And generally when that happens, like, ain't nobody got time to <laughs> think about other things. I kind of want to use this pizza because I never use it. This is super old. It's from Wild Summer Designs, and I'm going to use it. Oops, it should be on this side. Should be on that side. Okay, and then I'm going to mark Yodob. Yodob. Don't ask me why I said it that way, because I don't know the answer. Yay! Um, was I filming this day? I don't remember what I was doing. What was I doing? YouTube. I was probably watching YouTube with me. So, let's use this whimsical cat cutie for that. She's so cute. Let me use her right there to mark that. And then Sunday, we're at Sunday, y'all. We've done it. I'm kind of shocked. Bay still, my goal is to do this before Bay gets home because I want to have food going. But I don't know if that's going to happen. So, oh well, I tried. Um, okay, and then Sunday, this was actually IHOP day, but since I already marked it on Saturday, I'm not marking it again. We'll just mark other things, and that's a okay. Um, I think I want a little bit more space. Okay, here we go. Um, I worked on orders. 
surprise, surprise. So I'm going to mark coffee. I'm just going to mark it regularly because I've used a lot of my coffee, seasonal coffees. So I want to use this Bubble Bear Studios. I think I'm going to use Bubble Bear Studios. If you guys hear that howl, it's the dog upstairs because he does not like being alone. He's super cute, like a cutie, um, but does not like being alone. And the owner is away. She usually works from home though, so most of the time it's fine. But there are times where she needs to leave her house, surprisingly. Um, I packed orders this day. Ooh, an exciting time. We're going to mark that. I have a fun little box and cactus girl I think I'm going to use for that right here. So cute. To mark, oops. To mark that, I want to use, I think, one of the square boxes for this one. Here we go. I think I'm going to have to use gold because the green is kind of taken. I'm like, where are my tweez? Where are my tweezies? Here we go. Really? The way it went down like that, but I definitely had it down like right. <laughs> Just like WTF. Now I feel like it's going to be crooked regardless because that's what happens. Put it down crooked once, she stays crooked. It's fine. And I went to visit mom and pops this day. Seems like dad was okay, so that's good. Um, I don't want to use that again. So I guess I'll use the red to mark that. I was working nonstop this. This was a wild week for work. I was working nonstop over the weekend with orders, which I appreciate. I'm so thankful for, but I was busy. <laughs> okay. Um, here we go. I'm like I need mom and dad stickers. I always use the same ones. Oh, another sheet bites the dust. These grandparent stickers is what I always use to mark visiting mom and pops. So that one bites the dust. And then I worked on orders for the rest of the night. So is it time for green again? It looks like it is. I think I want to use a pattern. I'm not loving these. I guess I'll use this one. Yeah, I'm gonna use this one. And I'm going to mark working on orders again. Because um, it looks like things are working again this day, and I really wanted to take advantage of that by working my little behind off. So I think I'm going to use this emoji to mark that from the Coffee Monsters Co. Okay. That's everything for the day by day. I have this sidebar, which I usually will put things that relate to whatever the hell is going on. But because this is a Christmassy spread, I'm going to mark Christmassy things. So like this super, super cute little like garland of stockings with little munchkins in them, I think is very appropriate right hither. So cute. And then a little gingerbread one, maybe. Or actually, I think I'm going to use a little gift box to mark my friend's birthday in this one. And there you have it, folks. There is my spread for the week of December 4th. Let me zoom you all out a bit. I think Bay is here, and literally, not a single pot is turned on, which is not ideal. Like, he'll be fine, but. I like to have it going, you know, but it's okay. We got a spread done. It's fine. All right, y'all. Let's just flip through what I have left. I did not use headers at all for this one. Um, okay, so we have a random washi, which I'm actually going to pop in my little washi stash. And here we go. Here's what we have left. I always have a lot on this page. 
and I hope you guys enjoyed the spread and the talk through and I'm so excited to finally have a Christmas spread done thank y'all so much for watching and I will see you guys real real soon here's a little wiggle for you don't forget to like and subscribe before you go there we go. All right. I'll see y'all real, real soon. Bye.